All right, we're here, 360 Heat Race number one winner, Clinton Gardner. And first off, I gotta say, wow, that was a heck of a race you put on for the fans. How was how was that from your perspective? Well, the track freed up a little bit. We missed it in qualifying again tonight. I'm not exactly sure where we're missing with this car early in the night, you know. But if we could just figure that part out, I think it'd be good. You know, the two times I've been here in a feature, it's been good. You know, last week we were leading and just had a small mishap in the engine, and so uh, you know. We've been biting each other's heads off for the last hour and a half. Maybe that heat race win will kind of get everybody back up on top and, uh, you know, break a smile or something. Did you make any changes to the car before the heat race after qualifying? Yeah, we've been trying our butt off. We changed, you know, we're changing all kinds of stuff. You know, it just with the humidity the way it is and the moisture that's in the racetrack, there's a lot of claws out there and the track's really pulling hard, but there's no good air to make the engines run. So. There's a couple things that come into the equation, you know, that are really hard to work around, you know. I, I, yeah, I don't know. We're trying our hardest. All right, we're here at 360 Heat Race number two winner, Tyler Grunendijk. Second week in a row winning the Heat Race. This time you had to come from a bit, far, a bit farther back. Yeah, I don't know why our start wasn't quite like it was lined up there on the board, but, uh, you know, it worked out. We had a good run getting into turn one and uh, got around and got past the lead there early on, and the car felt really pretty exceptional. So. Really happy. Uh, we're timed a little better tonight. Still need to do a little work there, but getting a lot closer to where we need to be, and uh, just keep working on this thing. It just keeps getting better. With two laps to go, we don't know if you. I don't know if you looked at the board or anything, but Calvin Landis just made a charge out of nowhere, going down in turn three and four. Yeah, you know the bottom actually looked pretty good down there. I just until I saw somebody, I didn't have any reason to change my line and and go down there. But I, I'm sure if somebody was rolling around there pretty good, they might have been making up some ground there. All right, we're here at 360 Heat Race number three winner Lee Gross. Right after the, right from the start, you just took the took the lead and away you went. Yeah, you know uh, we've been trying a few different things here, trying to get going. Uh, we struggled with the time trial and deal, and uh, we're just trying to get the car better. And uh, we got to change some things for that heat race, and I think it worked out. Uh, car car went pretty good. And you, you don't race here very much, and now you're back here again. Last time you raced was here was in around April time, or is this in preparation for the Knoxville Nationals? Yeah, you know, this, this is probably one of the toughest racetracks you can go to. It's just different from anywhere else. I haven't been to another place that's like it, and uh, you just got to come here and make laps and try some things and try and get better, and uh, we're hoping to come. You know, we came here this week and hoping to come back next week and uh, get ourselves a little better for Nationals. All right, we're here at 360 Heat Race number four winner, Josh Boffman. You had a great run the heat race. You had to come from about middle of the pack to get the heat race win. Yeah, this car's great. You know, I love this place. We always run decent here. Um, 360 car is perfect. I couldn't have got a better car there. Um, you know, now we got to go out there and see what we can do in the main. And you, you're doing double duty now. You want to? Is that in preparation for the Knoxville Nationals? Yeah, we didn't get to run our 410 earlier in the year here, so we figured, heck, why not? You know, we're here. We might as well try it. I don't know about my guys, but I'm pretty wore out. We'll, uh, we'll do, make the best laps we can here. The 410 is get a little bit better, but uh, you know we're in both shows here. All we can do is go forward from there. So. Well, you're looking great out there, and I wish you best of luck in both the 410 and the 360 features. Thank you very much.